When requests are intercepted by an Edge server, this will be evaluated against the security features on the left, starting with uh, IP Geo Firewall. So here, customers can choose to block specific IPs or requests coming from certain regions or make modifications to existing lists. Customers also have the option to block a specific AS numbers, um, add exceptions to the above lists, and if needed, they could use this geo control for uncertain conditions related to Ukraine disrupted areas. So to add a block list, I'm just going to go to the ellipsis sign and click on manage network lists. And here um, you can create a new list and um, add a name to it. And then select the type of list um, that it should be, whether you want to block um, IPs or want to block requests coming from a specific region and then just click on create new list. Now I already have uh, some examples on this uh, demo account. So I'm just gonna quickly pick one and um, show you how you can add a specific region. In this case, I'm gonna click on any name here and then it will give you the option to click on save. Same thing with um, IPs. If you want to add a specific IP that you're looking to block, just make sure you add the value and then uh, save. You also have the option in case you would like to add more than one IP or you have um, a long list of IPs to block, you could upload that via a CSV file and then just uh, save. So pretty much um, once you activate uh, your network list, um, it will start enforcing these conditions and um, just take into consideration in this case with these IP and geo controls. You can make changes to the list without having to version, having to save or activate a new security configuration. And as well, you could use the same list across different security policies or configurations for your convenience.